Hi everybody, this is Connie and I am here with a haul for you. I am going to do a few videos today, so you're going to see the same thing. I may change my lipstick in between each one, but that's about it. That is all I'm wearing today, by the way, is lipstick. I would like to do uh, get ready with me or to put makeup on, but it's just not in me. Um, I, I wanted to talk to you guys first. I found out the other day, um, I think I told you that I'm taking uh, B12 shots. I just had my third one, uh, my last weekly. I'm supposed to get them once a week for four weeks. So Tuesday will be my last weekly B12 shot. I don't feel any different yet, um, but hopefully that'll change. Um, and then I'm I'm going to do it uh, once a week for, or once a month for six months. So, and then um, I went to see Dr. Santos on Thursday. I'm not sure if I told you this already. Isn't that terrible? My memory just is so bad. But um, he said, I have to have a renal ultra, ultrasound, and that is this coming Friday. It is Saturday now. So this coming Friday, I think it's the third maybe of March. Um, and then in six weeks, then I will have more labs drawn and I will have a telemed with him, which means that he will be in another city where he, he mainly practices. He comes up here three times a month, but he um, mainly practices in another city. And so he will be there, and we will teleconference um, it, on a big screen. He'll be, he like the lady explained it, he's going to be big to me, and then I'm going to be big to him. <laughs> I already am big. But anyway, he is a very nice doctor. Um, and he said he wanted to get the scary stuff out of the way first. Having all the back pain that I've been having, Plus, my kidneys are not doing well. I have 40% kidney function um, in both kidneys, 40% all together. And that could mean melanoma of the kidneys. So renal cancer is what it is. So we're, we're just um, going to see this. Um, Lulu researched it a little bit and she said it is a highly uh, successful cancer to get rid of, I believe. So um, if it's can I already had somebody offer me their kidney. <laughs> but um, she's not the same blood type as me anyway. So, But uh, I thought it was wonderful of her as a co-worker. She just, out of the blue, she says, if you need a kidney, you can have one of mine. Isn't that something? Um, but she's not the same blood type as me, so that wouldn't work. Anyway, um, that's the scary stuff. And I'm having very, very high anxiety over it. So I'm going to try to get these videos done and put on a happy face although I'm scared to death and uh, I paced most of the day so I am um, twiddling my thumbs and trying to sit here and get through this. Um, Lulu said that I should call the doctor Monday and get some fast-acting anxiety drugs because um, I'm finding it hard to breathe. I'm finding it um, I'm pacing, like I said. I went and I walked up and down my block a few times this morning trying to get that excess anxiety out of there, but it hasn't worked. But anyway, um, you know, this could be as simple as changing my meds. But he, he is worried because I've only got 40% of my kidneys working. And I know that um, I don't go to the bathroom real often. There's days that I don't go, I'll go right away when I get up in the morning. I always have to go bad then. Um, and then some days I don't even go all the, while I'm at work. And I work, I'm there eight and a half hours 
and I do not go. And I, I've been trying to drink a lot because I have the dry mouth because of the Cymbalta. Um, or, or maybe I'll go once. And then I come home, and like last night, I didn't get home until 7.30, and that was the first time I went, and I about peed my pants. I had to go so bad. But that is from um, 6 a.m. when I first get up, till 7 30 at night I didn't go so anyway so let's get into this haul before it's terribly terribly long okay okay so um, the first this is two hauls the first one was like a week or so ago um, I just got a few things and you know a woman of my age um, my weight and everything and this may be attributed to the kidneys also I have trouble with leakage um, there's times that I can't quite make it to the bathroom there's times that if I sneeze or I cough I pee a little um, so I use pads um, what are these called liners panty liners every day of my life um, these are Walmart Walgreen brand and they were buy one get one so I've got another one I'm using too they're okay but I can feel them during the day and good panty liners you don't feel so these aren't the best then I got um, some hair bands I wear these um, down to about here every day um, not every day. I just started wearing them again because I, I sweat so bad. Being in the dish room, I'm over that hot water all day. And um, I sweat just pours off of me. And it usually goes right into my eyes and that burns and stuff. So I wear a headband to catch that. It also came with a couple of hair bands, which is great. By the way, I'm getting my hair done on Tuesday. Um, a cut trim or shaped and colored I'm gonna have um, highlight too so okay and the next thing is I bought one of the total temptations mascaras I'm not gonna open it because I'm gonna I still have got to go through my mascaras and get rid of some so I can add new in um, this is the non waterproof um, I don't like the waterproof because they're so hard to get off uh, this is Full Fluffy Lashes. Um, so addictive. Fluffy brush. 85% saw bold. Oh, I can't read that, sorry. Anyway, these are by Maybelline. And most of you, I'm sure, have heard about the Total Temptations. And it looks like the kind of brush that I'm going to like. So... Okay, there's that. Then I bought another um, CoverGirl Superstay Matte Ink Lipstick. And this one is in 60 Poet. Here's the one that I had. This one's the one I had. This is my new one. See, they're, they're kind of close, but the one that my new one is a little bit darker. And I really liked this one because it was on all day. After eating, after everything. So I will swatch it. Call darn little piece of plastic following me around every place I go. Let me try to get it off. There we go. And this is what the wand looks like. And there it is. Isn't that pretty? That is going to be such a pretty nude. All right, and the next thing and last thing that I got on that shopping trip is, um, this is Maybelline also. It says up to two days, uh, new Tattoo Studio Waterproof Brow Gel. Thought I'd give it a try. Let's see what it looks like. It looks like it's going to be okay. This is weird. Okay, so there it is. 
and it's got the squeezy tube. That looks nice. That looks promising. And then it comes with another wand that's got a longer. So if you don't like the short wands, then you've got the option of having the longer wand. I did not realize that. And this is in soft brown. And the writing is so dang small on this stuff, I cannot read it right now. My eyesight, um, I have realized, has gotten worse lately, too. I don't know what's going on. Okay, so let's get into the, the haul that I got today. Or, not today. Um, yes, mm, day before yesterday. I went to pick up my meds. And my meds, um, I've got $10 copay on most things. One of them was 20 And I got five meds, I believe. So $40, $60 in meds. So I got some painted M&Ms. I haven't bought these in forever, and I absolutely love them. So I thought I would treat myself. I bought some toothbrushes because I need them. Um, they're Oral-B Ultra Soft Comfort Trim Bristles for Gentle Clean. And I really like this because I have... Um, a lot of my teeth are coming away from my gums. So, okay. Then I got some secret... Um, gel i love the gel kind i found that i do not like the spray deodorants i don't like them at all because they spray everywhere and it's hard to breathe when you spray it so that cannot be good for the environment so anyway i this one here is lux lavender and this one is active fresh it was buy one get one this was also buy one get one it was i bought the dove Nutriv Solutions Color Care Shampoo and Conditioner. And I don't rem remember if I've used this. I know I love their shower um, gel. But I don't know if I have used their, their shampoo and conditioner. But that will be my next ones as soon as I'm done with what I've got. I also bought a couple of brushes. Three brushes, as a matter of fact. Buy one, get one. Um, and these are Detangle and Style. Perfect for home or travel. And this is detangle. And my hair, as it gets longer, is full of tangles. So I got those. Um, I also, this was on sale, um, like half price. And I like these. These are the Kotex uh, Security Ultra Thin uh, Long Pads. And they're like panty liners. These are pads, but they're like panty liners. They're really thin. I really like them a lot. I've had them before several times. Okay, so then makeup wise. <laughs> I got the Master Holographic by Face Studio by Maybelline. Prismatic highlighter. It's this one. I'll show you what it looks like here. I did run my finger through it, so you can probably see that. Look at that. Can you see that? It is pretty. Okay. Then I did a little bit of damage. Um, these lipsticks were not on sale, but they're new, and I could not decide on a color. So... I bought five of them. <laughs> you guys know that I do like the Burt's Bees lipsticks. So here we go. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to swatch each one for you. This one is 505 Peony Dew. I'm hoping you can see that. And they're glossy lipstick. So there, there is a, it's buildable color, but it, they are pretty sheer, which is nice for work. Isn't that pretty? And you can tell it's glossy. But that is such a pretty color. Okay. Now, I, I probably won't get rid of any lipsticks out of my deal. I will, there's a lot of lipstick, liquid lipsticks that I probably will put in my drawer, and then I will put this in with my minis. 
you know, that's just the way it is. So I probably won't get to Sioux Falls. Um, we've gotten eight inches of snow in the last two days. So, um, oh man, when I was at the doctor's office the other day, I ha I drove all over town, and I tell you what, um, it was dangerous. It was dangerous. You could not see see where you were on the road. Um, so I always made sure I followed somebody because you could not see. Um, every place I went, I had to clean off my car. This is 503 Nude Mist. Let's see if I can do this, if it works better. I can't tell if that is clearing up or not. I'm sorry. But that is this one over here. See, they're kind of similar, but yet they're different enough where they're really different enough. This one is 504 Nude Rain. Get my head out of the way. I'm sorry if you can't see that. And I can't tell in my viewfinder if it's clear or not. This one's got a little bit more color payoff. Maybe I should show you the lipstick. Jeez, I don't think I have been. These were $8.99 a piece. This one is 517 Pink Pool. And the last one is 515. Rose Falls. And I'll put that underneath the other one. Well, I'll put it here. These last two seem to have a little bit better color payoff. Okay, and then I bought one other lipstick. And this is one of the new Maybelline, I do believe. Hang on a second here. Color sensation, isn't that? I cannot zone in on that. But it is 700 Nocturnal Rose. And it's in this kind of packaging. Isn't that Maybelline? Oh my God. Connie, get it together. Look at how pretty that is. Oh my gosh. And look at there. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at there, those colors. I will be keeping my um, liquid, the Maybelline, um, these here liquid lipsticks out because I really like them. But um, even Tarte doesn't last as long. It, you know, none of them last as long as that one does that I have worn so far. I'm still not done with my liquid lipsticks yet. Um, this week I'll probably be done. And then we will start over on the bullet lipsticks on my stand. So anyway, that is my Walmart haul. I will be back with you with um, a couple more. I'll talk to you very soon. If you like this kind of stuff, please give me a thumbs up, and I will talk to you very soon. Bye-bye.